This is their new album. It's entitled Happy Planet. And right now they're going to perform a song called Country of Man. Here is Wall of Voodoo. It's a pleasure to have you here. As you know, this is our tribute to white people, uh, Friday night, and uh, you're proud to be a part of it because somebody came up to me last night and said there were no white people on the show, and uh, if there are any black people in the studio tonight, you'll be ejected, you'll be thrown out. Uh, no black people here tonight. This is a tribute to white people, and I want you to explain... <laughs> I'm joking, I'm a comedian. Relax, okay? It's... I want you to explain some of this stuff, man. I know okay. they're curious, I'm curious. Let's start over here. What's the deal? These things here... Hello? Yeah. Uh, is, is he on mic? Is everything all right? Oh, we got a boom. Oh. And they call it that because if you were oh. taller, it would say boom, boom. And it would hit you in the head. No, let... These here are uh, voodoo flags. <laughs> These are doorways to the spirit world. These come from Haiti. Mm -hmm. This here offers you fame. If you want, you ask the spirit inside. If you want fame and wealth, he'll give it to you. 
This is good health. This one here is free coffee and donuts. <laughs> Apparently the police in L.A. will like to have that one in their house. So. <laughs> this one here lets you see reruns of the old Dick Van Dyke show. So they're... <laughs> now, <laughs> I don't know about Elvis here. That, that confuses me. What's that about? These are our American heroes. Elvis Presley. The Thank Madonna you very much. Guadalupe. And uh, Elvis. And, of course, Sammy Dog Jr. The one-man dog show in Las Vegas. Wait, you, you have to explain that. Sammy Dog Jr., Sammy the one-man... Sammy Dog Jr., he's, a, he's our mascot. He follows us everywhere. Poor Sam cousin of Sammy Davis. Sammy, Sammy Dog. Dog. So he's the poor cousin of Sammy Davis. The poor cousin of Sammy Davis. Sammy Dog. Sammy Dog. I heard that. He looks like he got a, a, a Mr. T starter kit here on. Yeah. And, uh, he, he looks like he's doing all right. He it's don't look poor to me. Yeah, it's, 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 kind of it's, it's happening. He's, he's wearing these, these shoes that only an IBM salesman would love. These are real nice here. And this is amazing, man. What's the stuff over here? The, what's the cactus represent? Um, the desert. The desert. <laughs> How stupid of me, you know? <laughs> That's why I haven't worked before this week. Uh, amazing. And, and this stuff over here? Same thing. This is, um, this is good luck at the racetrack. That's good and, luck at the um, racetrack. This is, uh, we don't know yet. This is when it causes all the problems. Causes all the, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> because you don't know. That's and it's confusing. Where did the name come from? The name came from an offhanded remark somebody made years ago in a recording studio when we were trying to come across, come up with an, asking him if we had the wall of sound. They said, uh-uh, man, sounds like you got a wall of voodoo. So up to that point, we were called the Career Girls. <clears throat> <laughs> we used to get beat up for that name. I won't comment. I won't say anything. You're on tour now? Yeah, we're heading up to Australia in the middle of July. That sounds great. You're going to go to Australia and check them out. You're going to come back and do another song later? Yeah. Okay. We'll be right back with Wall of Voodoo and another song and a comedian, David Spood. And uh, much...